All right. Hey everybody. Welcome back to In the Kitchen with Ken. You see we've already gotten started. I've got already gotten a lot done, so we're just gonna put some hot dogs together. Now I'm doing this because this weekend it's the 4th of July. I thought this would be a nice little, nice little something easy, simple that you can do for the family, and a little spin on some, some old goodies. So what we've got first off, um, we're gonna do just a plain old Carolina hot dog. Now with that, I've got these Deet Watts, Watson um, Beef Franks that we put out on the grill. Got a little bit of coleslaw. I'm gonna put to, put on here. Love coleslaw. We got a little bit of our chili. We cooked up. I didn't cook a lot, just enough to. If somebody was interested in having some on there, like I said, we're not gonna go too hard on these. We've got that. We'll put a little bit of mustard on it. And there's our first hot dog. Look at that. Nice and pretty. It's ready to go. We'll set that aside. I did go ahead and toast all of these buns. Just, I love, I'd rather have a toasted bun on there. Now for our second hot dog, we're going to kind of do it just a little classic. Little American style hot dog. Some with a little bit extras that everybody loves. Now I've got some macaroni and cheese. I know that's a little different. Instead of putting regular cheese on here. Run that along the side. I'm gonna let my macaroni and cheese get a little cold. Disappointed myself. Put a little, little dill pickle along the edge. Some tomatoes. Look how pretty that is. And of course, a little bit of bacon. Look at that. Tell me that won't be the life of the party. Set that one down on the plate. Now the last one, this is where we're gonna get a little bit more complicated. What I've done is I've got a little bit of Mexican queso cheese. I'll pop that down on the bottom of the bun. Look at this stuff. Like oozy and runny, really good. And you can get this at any, any of the local stores. Oh man. Cannot wait to try this one. Be careful with it though, because it's gonna be hot, hot, hot. I'm gonna drop our hot dog down on there. And on top of that, I've got a little tomatilla salsa we're gonna put on here. Look at that. Nice little spice to it, a little kick. You're gonna add a couple of things. Wedges of avocado on there. Look how pretty that looks. Now, for a little spice on it, got some little cayenne pepper, a little crushed red pepper. Look at that. How pretty is that? Yeah, let's give this sucker a try. Mmm. That heat. And that tomatillo salsa, so good. A little creaminess from that avocado. And I love the bite to these Dietz Watson beef dogs. They are so good, they are delicious. Well, I hope you give these recipes a try for 4th of July, and I hope you have a good weekend. We'll see you next time on In the, In the Kitchen with Ken. Bye now.